We are, by nature, explorers. The same curiosity that sends us to the stars at the speed of thought. We are proceeding into the neutral zone. Urges us to go there in reality. Ignition sequence start. Six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. All engine running. Liftoff. We have a liftoff. 32 minutes past the hour. Liftoff on Apollo 11. But whenever we make a great new leap, like the moon landings, we elevate humanity, bring people and nations together, usher new discoveries and new technologies. Oh, I'm getting your good at one minute. You're looking right to us, Eagle. Just 50 minutes from now, well within the hour, the moon is due to have visitors from another planet. We are entering an increasingly dangerous period of our history. Our population and our use of the finite resources of planet Earth are growing exponentially. Along with our technical ability to change the environment for good or ill. It will be difficult enough to avoid disaster in the next hundred years let alone the next thousand or million. Our only chance of long-term survival is not to remain inward-looking on planet Earth, but to spread out into space. For the first time in nearly half a century, NASA has built a rocket that can send astronauts back to the moon. The space launch system Artemis, the rocket is longer than a football field, more powerful than the famous Saturn V from the Apollo program, which last flew in 1973. Within 50 years, I have no doubt, there will be settlements on the moon. And by the end of the century, I truly hope, humans will be living on Mars. Many years ago, the great British explorer George Mallory, who was to die on Mount Everest, was asked why did he want to climb it. He said because it is there. Well, space is there. And we're going to climb it. And the moon and the planets are there. And new hopes for knowledge and peace are there. And therefore, as we set sail, we ask God's blessing on the most hazardous and dangerous and greatest adventure on which man has ever embarked. Go, 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 I want to share my excitement and enthusiasm about this quest. So remember to look up at the stars and not down at your feet. Try to make sense of what you see and wonder about what makes the universe exist. Be curious. Tranquility Base here. The Eagle has landed. The lunar age has begun. <laughs>